Hey guys, welcome back to part 37, I think, of The Legend of Zelda and the Minish Cap. My favourite Zelda game of all time, because it's awesome. Alright, last time we got the uh, third and final book, so now we're going to be returning it. There you go. No, ah, stop it! She does it every time! Oh my god, it's crazy guy that screamed at us. <laughs> and he can balance books on his head really well. That's creepy. The bookshelves are back in order. Okay. Now that we've returned the books, we can, uh... <clears throat> the books can lead us up to the, the Elder. So let's go do that. And hopefully fuse some kinstones with some minish on the way up. Because I have lots of kinstones right now. <laughs> yep. Uh, that, that blue book wasn't there before, so. Ooh, how interesting. Oh, he gave us money. <laughs> okay, talk to him to get some money when you've got on the books back. There's a little thing for you that I didn't even know about. Well, I, pro I did. I've probably done it before. I just didn't remember. Because it's not exactly something you remember. But yeah. Okay. Let's go see the Elder. I think you can do a Kinstone fusion with him, actually. If not now, then later in the game. And there's the other two books we got. And here's another book that was already here. What if someone took the book that he lives in? Would he, like, die or something? I mean, he's peeled this book apart. There must Someone would just open it and a, a tiny minish lamp would fall out. Be, yeah, you can do a fusion with him. It kind of creeps on people. I don't think I... Ha That's the only one I don't have. What the hell? I have, like, every single kinstone ever created by man or Minish. But I don't have that one. Oh, my God. Oh, a visit after many long weeks. Even Jatari has been away so long. I've grown almost lonely. But what is it? You, what do you need? Hmm, do you want to visit that temple of droplets? Well, very well. You're the first such brave person in a long while. Stand on the clover in front of me. All right, all right. You kids, they have no patience for an old man. Well, go stand over there, just like I told you. Whoa, ho, ho. Now open my secret panel. What? Oh my god! Asshole! Whoa, wasn't that fantastic? Gotta pass the trial safely and recover the tools you need. Okay, mini dungeon! Shut up, shut up, Ezlo! Shut up! Oh my good lord, he's... Oh my god. Okay, so this is where we get the item that allows us to swim. And that's how you get to the Temple of Droplets. So, uh, once we've gotten this, I'll be doing a lot of side quests that involves swimming. Yay for you guys watching that. Uh, I know, side quests are always fun. So, um, yeah. Here we are. Mini dungeon. Good music. Lots of pots. Always fun. Uh, die, die. Okay, these guys, I don't know what they're called, but they're some kind of weird center ant thingy. I forget what this animal is called. Basically, just don't attack. It throws its blue things at you. You can hit them. You have to attack it from the side or the back, because if you hit its fang thingies, or pincers or whatever they're... Whatever they are. Like my mind has gone blank right now. Uh, you bounce off if you hit their blue things. So just hit them from the side or the back, and that's how you kill them. And here's the chest. You've got the flippers. Press A to glide through water, and B to dive. Okay. So now... Yeah! We can swim and dive. Uh, you should dive. There is certain places you dive to get items, and uh, being able to swim is awesome. Now that we can swim, we can go through the rest of this dungeon. And here's an item I can't get yet. We'll have to remember that's there and come back later. I will come back later for that, if it kills me. Which it probably will. What's through here? Okay, this is where we came from. Yeah, basically just spam A and you go really, really quickly, and then if you let go of A, you go pretty slow. And here's the exit, maybe. Yeah. Okay, so the Temple of Droplets is right there. Alright, so now we can swim. As Minish or as a uh, human, which is good, because I said so. Alright, so now we have the ability to swim. There are a lot more things available to us. And I mean a lot more, so uh, this part is basically just going to be full of me going and doing those things. First thing I want to do is in the Minish Woods, so I'm going to be going there. Doo -doo 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 -doo. 
we Minish Woods. Here we are. Alright. Oh, there's a bomb guy. I don't think he has those bombs yet. Yeah, I've got a few kinstones with somebody. I think it's actually somebody in this village, so I will walk around this village and look for people to fuse kinstones with. I think it might be this big guy, actually. Nope. So, yeah. I'm pretty sure it's a minish that he fuse with to uh, get him the ability to... Oh, whoops. To give him the ability to uh, uh, make remote bombs. Oh, it could be this guy. I have that one. Da -da 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 -da. For Starry. Da -da 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 -da. Come on. Damn it. It's not it. Uh, a chest, probably. Hey guys, welcome back to part 37. <coughs> Mega glitch. Basically, the game crashed. And I fixed it because I'm amazing. So let's continue with this Kinstone Fusion, which you've already seen. But this is where I got up to when I was fixing my save data, because basically I just lost everything. Whatever. It's all in the past. It's fine. It only took me like five minutes. Don't crash. Don't crash. Okay, it didn't crash. So, our health is probably different. I don't know. You should know, because you were just watching it. I wasn't. So there you go. Our health and uh, probably our money will be different as well. But I do remember what I was doing. I was uh, doing something. Yeah. Yeah, I just got the flippers and I was doing side quests with those flippers. So, yay. Wrong way. Alright. So, the side quest I want to do is a piece of heart. It's in the Minish Woods. Uh, I think there's actually quite a few side quests to do in the Minish Woods with the flippers now that we have them. I think I'll. Oh, yeah, I think I just remembered a couple. So, uh, also, we'd have to take those. And I haven't done this yet. This was. Uh, a kinstone fusion that I did quite a while ago. And it got me another kinstone piece. I hate it when kinstone fusions unlock places for you to get kinstone pieces. It just, it's completely redundant. It solves nothing. It's like, use a kinstone to get a kinstone, and I can just get kinstone using white pick -a light anyway. 